physicists created slits in time and discovered unexpected physics in an experiment. Scientists have achieved a temporal analog to the famous double slit experiment that could lead to new optical technologies. Becky Ferreira on Vice reports, scientists have discovered unexpected physics by opening up slits in time, a new study reports, achieving a long-standing dream that can help to probe the behavior of light and pioneer advanced optical technologies. The mind-boggling approach is a time-based variant on the famous double-slit experiment first performed by Thomas Young in 1801, which opens a window into the weird, probabilistic world of quantum mechanics by revealing the dual nature of light as both a particle and a wave. The new temporal version of this test offers a glimpse of the mysterious physics that occur at ultra-fast timescales, which may inform the development of quantum computing systems, among other next-generation applications. In the original version of the double-slit experiment, light passes through two slits that are spatially separated on an opaque screen. A detector on the other side of the screen records the pattern of light waves that emerges from the slits. These experiments show that the light waves change direction and interfere with each other after going through the slits, demonstrating that light behaves as both a wave and a particle. This insight is one of the most important milestones in our ongoing journey into the quantum world, and it has since been repeated with other entities, such as electrons, exposing the triply phenomena that occurs at the small scales of atoms. Now scientists led by Romain Trirol, PhD student studying nanophotonics at Imperial College London, have created a temporal analog of Young's slit experiment by firing a beam of light at a special metamaterial called indium tin oxide, according to the study published on Monday in Nature Physics. Metamaterials are artificial creations endowed with superpowers that are not found in nature. For instance, the indium tin oxide used in the new study can change its properties in mere femtoseconds, a unique quality, a, a unit equal to a millionth of a billionth of a second. This incredible variability allows light waves to interact with the metamaterial at key moments in ultra-fast succession called time slits, which produce a time-based diffraction pattern that is analogous to the results returned in the spatial version of the experiment. Showing diffraction from a double slit in time requires to flick a switch extremely fast on time scales comparable to how fast the light field oscillates about a few femtoseconds, said Tyrol in an email to Motherboard. If the entire history of the universe from the Big Bang to the moment you read this was a second, an oscillation of light would only take the equivalent of a single day. Switching at this speed has long been difficult, but a few years ago, a new material, indium tin oxide, which already covers the screens of our mobile phones or televisions, was shown to switch very fast when you shine an intense laser beam on it, he said. This has enabled a rapid progress of the field. See, for example, a conference we are organizing, he said. In other words, the super speedy changeability of indium tin oxide finally made a time split slit experiment possible after many years of eluding scientists. To bring this version, the vision to reality, Tyrol and his colleagues used lasers to switch the, refract, the reflectance of the material on and off at high speeds. And when the material was turned on, it essentially became a mirror that allowed the team to record the diffraction patterns of light beams that interacted with a highly reflective surface. The brief moments when light was reflected off the metamaterial mirror state were so the so-called time slits that form the basis of the experiment. The separation between these slits determined the pattern of oscillations that were observed by the researchers. To the team's astonishment, the results of the experiment revealed more oscillations than predicted by existing theories, as well as far sharper observations which points to unexpected physics in the findings, according to their study. When we measured the spectra, we were very surprised by how clear they showed up on the detectors, Tyrol said. 
how visible these oscillations are depends on how fast we can switch our metasurface on and off. And this means that the speed at which our metamaterial changes is much faster than what was previously thought and accepted. This is exciting as it implies that new physical mechanisms are still to be uncovered and exploited. In our experiment, we saw that this wonder material has an even faster switching speed, 10 to 100 times faster than previously thought, which enables much stronger control of light, he said. This temporal version of the double split experiment, the slit experiment, altered the frequency of the light, changing its color, which created distinctive patterns in which some colors were enhanced while others were canceled out. The results are similar to the patterns created by the traditional spatial version of the test, which produces light waves that bolster and nullify each other after they have passed through the slits. The breakthrough paves the way towards new research into the enigmatic properties of light and the many emerging technologies that rely on optical phenomena. Tyrol and his colleagues are especially eager to try to repeat the experiment with the time crystal, a very strange quantum system that has re revolutionized many fields in physics. A double split a slit experiment in this first brick is the first brick on the road to more complex temporal modulations, such as the much sought time crystal, where the optical properties are temporarily modulated in a periodic fashion, Tyrol said. This could have very important implications for light amplification, light control, for example, for computation, and maybe even quantum computation with light. And this is on Vice by Becky Ferreira. Please leave your comments. and Thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box.